Uh, Keith, a disappointing result here at the RSC against Galway. Yeah, really poor. Disappointing is is, is an understatement. Um, we take the lead. Uh, we, we miss a penalty. Um, to double our advantage in the first half, started the game really well. Uh, to be fair to Galway, they came into it um, in the second half of the of the first half. Um, <clears throat> and they started the, the second half a lot brighter than we did. We, you know, so... But we can't concede the goals that we conceded at any level of the game. You can't, and you do not see goals that we've conceded tonight in any level of the game. And that's the disappointing thing. You know, the supporters come here to watch the team play. You know, our defending is really, really poor. Um, you know, and we're disappointed with that. Extremely disappointed with that. We haven't kept enough clean sheets all year. Um, and Galway come and they have a game plan, they have a way of playing, they're very, very organised, very good at what they do, they've got some really good players, you know they're going to test you, first phase, second phase, um, we just didn't do enough. The second goal especially, when the ball came back off the crossbar, nobody seemed to react, uh, Keith, so didn't? Well, the wall is there to do a job, so first and first foremost, the ball goes through the wall, it takes a deflection, hits the crossbar, comes back out, and we're, we're second to it, so... Um, Galway showed more, showed more hunger in those moments. They fight and scrap for everything. First goal is really poor. You know, we get torn in the box. We don't land on the second ball in the middle of the park. Um, and then we huffed and puffed. You know, we didn't really create a huge amount. Galway drop drop off, uh, get bodies behind the ball, make life really difficult for you. And uh, <clears throat> we got what, exactly what we deserved from the game, which was nothing tonight, unfortunately. And it's poor. It's poor uh, in terms of defending. And I suppose it's my responsibility. You know, so I keep picking the team. You know, I, I uh, <coughs> you know, we put a team out that that, that we think um, is going to be effective. We think that we can get a get a good performance last week. Really, really good away from home against Pats, even though the scoreline didn't reflect it. Um, but tonight, just not good enough. Not good enough in the duels. Not good enough winning tackles, winning headers, doing the basics of the game. Just, you know. So, um, yeah. And when you look at the start, you know, goal after a couple of minutes, brilliant start, Keith. Yeah, no, great, a great start. Um, and, and like I said, we should have doubled the advantage from the, from the penalty spot. So um, disappointed with that. Podge has been immense for us all year. Our tallies, man, has been really, really good. So uh, th these things happen. We go again, you know, but we had a great start to the game. But we didn't, we didn't follow that through. We didn't get on it and play enough. Um, the game becomes a little bit scrappy. And, you know, listen, uh, we, we, you've got to keep clean sheets in football to give yourself a, a platform to try and play. And we haven't kept enough this year. You know, we I think we kept five clean sheets all season, and that's just not good enough uh, for a team with aspirations of maybe, you know, uh, kicking on into the second half of the season. Our form just hasn't been good enough. And again, I suppose when you when you strip everything back and you and you look at things in the cold light of day, you know, it comes down to me. It comes down to the the, the, the management of the team. It comes down to you know team selection. It comes down to personality. It comes down to you know, haven't been accountable, having players on the pitch that are accountable, you know, and responsible for their performances. Um, and we've just been a little bit shy of that. We've got a young side. I'm not, you know, they're a young team, one of the youngest team, if not the youngest team in, in, in the league. But that's not an excuse. You still have to have personality. You still have to have character. You still have to go out and defend the moments. And that's all it is in the game. And like I said to you earlier, you just don't see those uh, goals conceded from top teams, from good teams. You know, poor teams can see goals like that. And, you know, at no level of football, you know, should you be seeing goals like that, they're, 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 they're terrible. And finally, Keith, how are you going to approach the last four games of the season now? You have to try and lift them and finish yeah. the season as best you can. Well, lift everybody, because the, the supporters come in um, tonight, they go home flat, they don't see a, re a performance that reflects, you know, them, you know, coming in. They want to see a team that gets them on the edge of their seats. We, we've done none of that tonight, you know, so we've got to... You know, we've got to try and pick up a win. It's going to be tough. The next four games, you know, and attack the back end of the season. You know, that's all we can do. Results tonight, teams have, have uh, obviously gained ground on us. Um, Galway have extended uh, their advantage on us in, in the league table. So we've just got to try and play for each other, play for the club, and represent the club well on the, on the football pitch. And, we, you know, we've got boys there that are hungry, that want to play. You know, and just unfortunately, we haven't kept enough clean sheets this year. We've got to try and get after that. If we can keep clean sheets, it gives ourselves a chance to win football matches. But, you know, we'll just have to dust ourselves down. It's difficult. It's hard to come out here to find the right words after after witnessing that. Um, 
Um, so, so I may not be right on the money in terms of, you know, when you look back, when you look back in the cold light of day, the detail, you know, but ultimately you can't cough up the goals we conceded tonight and have any chance of winning football matches.